September 1st, 11 a.m., a new drop. It's a wonderful day. We got three hoodies. I really like this one because the material we use here is like a carpet towel sort of embroidery. This is one of my favorite drops so far. Pink was my favorite color, but you know. Make sure to follow us on Instagram and cop this at strawberrypark.store. This is y'all's favorite show, Thousand Pound Sisters. Thousand. Here we go. This is the best moment. Is this healthy? No, but the show is good. Is it the beef mac and cheese? So did I have the surgery? We're gonna have to eat better. Yo. Quit eating a lot. We gotta learn some good recipes. Bye bye, Slappa Joe. Holy shit. It amazes me that people let themselves get this big, honestly. It's crazy. Damn, their head got a little belly. Sorry, 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 sorry. Head, said, <laughs> their head got a little belly. <laughs> look at that frame, 32, look at that. But it's like, yeah, you get your body to unproportional si like sizes that... How do you get like that? <laughs> Her head got a belly. <laughs> No mean shit, they'll be dead within a decade. How do you, you keep it up? Uh, that stuff's already been running through your blood yeah. that much. Even if you reverse it, your body's like still adapted to only that. It's so much hard going back. Can like, you get like a, can you die from withdrawals? Lack of Snickers. <laughs> oh shit. Because <laughs> there's people that like, if you do vegan for like five years, somebody said when they had steak, they like threw up right oh. in the ER because their your gut actually is so used to eating what you're eating. So when you, you shock it with something yeah. it shouldn't be, if they start trying to eat healthy, they're going to die by a salad. Like I saw a video of a guy who hadn't had water his entire life. He had only had Whoa, whoa. Other types of drinks, and when he tried to drink water, he threw up. <laughs> the head belly. <laughs> oh my god! It's thirty seconds in. We can't even. Because I'm not weight, I don't have cartilage in between my bones and my knee. They pop out of place and they grind when I'm walking. Yeah, that don't sound right. <laughs> That's osteoporosis, d oh. <laughs> I'm nervous about this eight-hour trip because me and Tammy tend to fight when we get in closed locations. I'm hoping everybody makes it to Atlanta alive, but I can't make no promises. I see why this is a show. This is entertainment. Look at this. How is that real, bruh? I feel bad, but it's like fun. She looked like a super villain. She walked 30 feet. <sighs> she abused the food, and that's what happened. If you're 300 pounds, I'm still gonna sympathize. You you had 500. There's a movie called Spirited Away, and there's a huge baby. I've seen that too. I've seen videos of like little Asian babies, like too overweight. Oh, I've seen some. It's like, look how cute he is. No, 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 no. This looks like a Spirited Away baby. But I'm sure you have to stop and use the bathroom. No, I'm on garden for a <laughs> that would surprise me. <laughs> Shut up. Look at that face. You lose yourself. Like your aesthetic, your looks, like is just fat. But even if you lost all that weight on your face, which is probably impossible at this point, wouldn't you just have this extra droop skin then? No, no. Yeah. You would have to get surgery. You, you would have to get this, like the skin surgery thing. Someone that big and you lose the weight. Even if your belly gets too big and you lose weight, you have loose skin forever. Oh yeah. Just your, you yeah, stretched totally, it. Yeah, totally, man. You can't. You cut your loose skin off, but then you just have big scars everywhere, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I thought about getting diapers for Tammy. I'm not really sure if they make any big enough. I'm not sure if they make anything big enough for me. <laughs> or Michael. <laughs> Tonight, we decided to eat some country buffet. We're gonna have one last supper. <laughs> I knew it were you. <laughs> you can take you anywhere. We're gonna start packing for Elena. I'm excited. It's like our second honeymoon. The enabler. Fuck. I don't want to hear the gorillas. I want to be three doors down. <laughs> Am I still here? Twerk, 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 twerk. You twerk. <laughs> I only do that when I play my little dinosaur. <laughs> do the cabbage patch. No. They're having fun. <laughs> Last time I weighed myself, it was at home on a scale, and it said I was 350. But I think my scale at home was broken, and I've been afraid to buy a new one. This is the moment. Oh, hey! You keep going up. Don't go over five.
Go! Oh. 406. Gotta go to a industrial hardware Lowe's to get weighed. Seeing that number on the scale just made my heart drop. Why is she crying like she didn't know? <laughs> you had to go to Lowe's to get weighed. I thought, you was, knew, I thought it was three. You knew the number was gonna be bad. More zeros than it really, really was. Makes me feel like, I don't know, just kind of like. I know your frustration. I'm gonna put on weight too, dude. You know what I've been eating? The mozzarella sticks are hanging out. <laughs> And they gotta hype each other up, like, no, we're both mad. That's your keg. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a barrel. Oh, oh they're never going up fast! Oh, shit! Oh, it ain't stopping. 6.05. No, 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 no. Don't start crying. No, no water works right now. <laughs> I didn't know. It's my fault and I'm the size. This one a fart. Oh my oh. god. Amy it was me. <laughs> was me. Lena. That was me. No. They don't even no. window or nothing. It's gross. <laughs> Generally speaking, the work that I do is connecting people to younger aspects of themselves. What would you like to accomplish today? Tonight. No more Doritos. <laughs> Meet Becky, and she immediately started playing with this glass bowl, made a bowl thing. Kind of cool. I'm wondering um, when the pattern of overeating began. How long ago? Long ago. <laughs> All my life. All your life, yeah. You're getting sleepy. She's laughing. She's like, she's 36. I'm surprised she made it that far. Nah, once you get into the 40s, you're done. Yeah, I think like I, I think the diabetes and whatever, like by four, mid 40s, she's not gonna make it. You know what's crazy? Have y'all ever seen a morbidly obese elderly person? That's a good point. You haven't. They, they die. They don't get that. They don't get that far. Up to 35 is your prime, like for anybody's body, but if you work as hard as you can, and that's why because their body's as healthy, it's a healthier young body, but you just filled it with shit. Yeah, you never seen an 80 year old overly, overly weight yeah. woman. So the body positivity and obese and stuff. Go to a nursing home and how many of them are like more. Now, I'll be fair, there are super fat old people. That is true. But how many do you see compared to the latter? There's far more thinner ones because the fat thing will fucking kill you. Like, yeah, it's not a good thing. It's heart, like, heart disease, cardiovascular disease. That shit will take you out. Just, so I see you're both sipping on something. What are you drinking? I'm drinking dad soda. About how many soft drinks are you guys drinking in a day? I can't kill. <laughs> it's a lot. What would you say is a lot? You're uh, six cans a day? More than that, probably. Yo. Six. 10 to 12, you drink a yeah. lot. 10 to 12 sodas a day, doctor. <laughs> At least I'm honest. No, no, I want you to be honest, but those diet sodas are gonna make you gain weight. That's some Think about how big that shirt is, though. Like, where do you get that? That's not a wall. That's that fabric from Joanne's. Pieced together, I think. That's a duvet, and they cut some holes in there. Not it. I know. I'm sure this is an old clip. I wonder what they look like now. She's all sexy and shit. Tammy. <laughs> 1,000 pound sister star Tammy Slayton is showing off her dramatic weight loss. The reality star is seen in new photos shared by her sister Amy. Slayton okay. Oh, wait. Wow. She actually lost a lot. Poses standing without her wheelchair and grinning. Had a blast last night. Totally embarrassed myself, but it was fun. Now to go pick up my boys. Can't wait to see my new. Oh, and she's 36. Yeah, 36. Right now, reads. this moment. Hands react. But she lost a lot of weight. Okay, but she lost a lot. Respect for her losing the weight. Youthful look though to her, almost. Maybe that's what happens when the body just. I was saying when your when your face is this, and then you you can't help but to look old. So what about the stress that is? You, what if your brain's pumping out stress from all the work you have to do? The inflammation that your body goes through. Hair thinning. Like you yeah. just you just aged up. One person wrote. Seeing Tammy stand on her own is so heartwarming. Proud of y'all's progress. This past season on the show, 
Tammy checked into a facility and eventually qualified for weight loss surgery. There you go. The moment when Tammy initially got approved by Dr. Smith on the hit reality series made the star get emotional and excited for qualifying. I guess the big question yep. that I want to know is, where's our way? Are you sure you want to know? I do want to know. It's under 550. Really? Yes. But that was it? Only 50 pounds? 534. Wow, that is awesome. Don't cry you, now. You, you left me speechless, and that, that usually doesn't happen. Well, that's great. I'm happy that they lost weight. That's what I was rooting for. They had good spirits going through it, I would say, you know, joking around or whatever they're talking about. Mm -hmm. I'm happy.